Hello faculty, staff, students, alumni, and more. You are all now about to embark on an epic quest to combat hunger. A night quest, in fact. My name is Derek Weitzel, and I'm the senior events planner here at Central Bank College and a member of the group planning night quest for this year. I wanted to take a couple minutes to show you how to sign your team up to join or to join a team for night quest 2020 combat hunger. But before we begin, I want to remind you that we have three go goals of the campaign, which runs from September 21st until the end of December. We are looking to raise funds to donate to food pantry partners, to volunteer at these partners, and to get food donations to either give to the college food pantry or, of course, to these partners as well if they're accepting donations. Each week, we'll keep track and give out pretty cool prizes to our team leaders. So to fundraise for NightQuest 2020, what you'll need to do is go to our Give Butter campaign page. You can either find this by going from our centralpen.edu website and linking through to it through the advancement page, or you can go straight to the link, which is up here, at uh, givebutter.com slash nightquest. So this uh, campaign uh, program and web page, Butter, it's a pretty fun and exciting platform and it makes fundraising really simple. Um, so go ahead, if you have a computer now, you can head over to givebutter.com slash nightquest. Um, this campaign, it's where you will see uh, more information about the campaign, which we can see it down here. Um, you can see who's donated, which is up here, or you can even see uh, you know, people that are participating, leaderboards, uh, social, you know, your social uh, information, and and whatnot. So there's a lot of a lot of great stuff on there. It's really clean, really simple. You know, there's also a place here where you can donate and. Um, what we're going to talk about next, uh, registering your team. So to do that, what you'll want to do is to click the blue fundraise button here at the top. So once you click that, um, a small window will pop up and will ask you to either join a team. So if, say you wanted to join my team, the Blue Barracudas, you click there um, and continue. Or you can create a new team. Now to do that, you click right here where it says or create a new team. So click that, a new thing pops up, and it will ask you to select a team logo and create a team name. Now you have to do both of these in order to create a team. So let's go ahead and pick a logo here quick, find something about an ice cream cone, and we're going to call our team the ice cream team, and then click continue. Alright, from there, now that I'm new and I haven't logged in yet, so the next part, what it will do is it will ask me to either create uh, an account via Facebook by linking it through that. You can sign up with an email, which I'd encourage, or if you already have an account, you can sign up. So I'm just going to click this since I already have an account and log in. All right, so it says, congratulations, you'll be re redirected to a campaign page. All right, now now I'm actually on my own personal fundraising page, um, which, you know, if you look here at the browser, it says givebutter.com slash nightquest slash ice cream team, which is my team name, and then my profile here, Derek White. So um, from here, you know, most of the stuff's the same. What's a little bit different is you see here your member information, how much you donated, or have had people donate your team, and then the total. So um, from here, what you can do is you can click Edit My Page, and you can set your personal goal. Um, you can also edit a story. So what would happen is right in between here, there would be your own little testimonial. You could say, you know, I'm. If, if you know if you know someone that was affected by hunger or you yourself, um, you, can, you can put a testimony or things there, um, and you know, of course the settings there as well. 
You can also go up here to click share. And from here, you can share your personal page. You can put that on Facebook, LinkedIn, you know, Messenger, Twitter, or email it out. And you can, or you can uh, use your main page link to, um, or just have uh, GiveButter do that for you and through sending it through uh, the automated invites. So this is a great tool, especially if you want to start getting donations or uh, inviting people to your team. You just want to make sure that you let them, if you're inviting people to your team, you just want to make sure that you let them know what your team name is. So, all right. And then up here, of course, is your profile. You can change you know, your image uh, for your profile and all that other good stuff, good support. From there, you probably will want to uh, invite people. So, as I mentioned, you can click share and invite people that way. Um, or you can always even too just take and click um, over here at your team, which now I'm at my team's fundraising page. Now I can see who's on my team, as well as um, you can see the, the other teams and see how, how we're matching up against them. Um, but from here, you can take that and then do this, click join, and, and send that to someone. And then what that will do is that will automatically bring up this team, join team slide, which as you can see there, so it's already saying a screen team. So if you want to simplify that, again, it's just you know, givebutter.com slash nightquest slash your team name. You know, if there's multiple words, there's hyphens slash join. And you can, of course, they'll follow the same process you did, except for selecting your team there. All right, so that's all you really need to know to get started with GiveButter and creating a team on uh, the, the NightQuest campaign page. Um, but if you, know, you have other questions about the campaign or about this program, um, or you need help, just email nightquest at centralpen.edu, and I'm sure that someone will assist you. Uh, so good luck, and thank you for being a part of this great event, and we uh, look forward to seeing everybody start to get donations, or you know, whether those be funds or uh, food donations, as well as see people volunteering. Uh, so take care.